Hey, what's going on? I'll play a little bit of this song. I'll teach it to you right afterwards. Cool. Um, so that's a little bit of the intro. I'll teach you the whole thing. Um, but anyway, here's what's going on. Right hand is playing D, F sharp, A, F sharp, C sharp, B, A, D, F sharp, A, F sharp, G. Um, left hand, um, I was playing just single notes, so left hand is playing a D. Dun, 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 F sharp, dun, 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 B, dun, 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 to a G. And by the way, I have kind of a bell sound effect. It would work great on piano sound effect, but um, that's what I have going because it sounds like the original. Um, so putting those two together, start from the beginning. D to the F sharp. You could play through a lot of the song with that. Um, another thing you can do as you're playing through um, is these chords. So left hand, um, well right hand is playing D, F sharp and A, while the left hand is playing a D, 1 and 5. For the F sharp, Left hand is playing F sharp and C sharp. Right hand is playing F sharp, A, C sharp. For B minor, right hand is playing B, D, F sharp, while left hand is playing B and the F sharp. For the G, right hand is playing G, B, D, left hand is playing G, 1 and 5 right there. Cool. When we go up, 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 butterfly, little higher, we'll go up, up, up. With a view a little nicer, a B my D won't be long now. Won't be long now. Cool. You can get through pretty much the whole song using that, or you could do that other part that we covered before. Either one will work fine through pretty much the whole song. The only part where it changes up the pattern is the is the bridge. And the bridge, it does the same chords, F sharp, A, C sharp with the F sharp, B, D, F sharp with the B minor, and G, B, D with the G. It just changes up the order of them. Um, so it starts with F sharp minor. If only B minor, a little more G time. F sharp minor. If only B minor. Add a little bit more G time with you. We go. Then we're back into the original patterns of, of the chorus. Um, so yeah, pretty much the whole song follows the uh, this pattern here: D, F sharp minor, B, and G. And it's, it's a great, really cool song. So hope it helped, and thanks for watching. See ya.